how you get somewhere without going there. A teleportation Teleport. Device? Okay. Yeah. You're so pretty. I wish there was a teleportal, like teleportal. right outside here. We're leaving our hostel today. Goodbye, yeah. hostel. And guess who got a haircut? Who? This queen. This bitch. No more hats for me. <laughs> what are we doing today? Uh, we're gonna go to Intramuros, and we're gonna go to Van Gogh's Bipolar, and we're gonna go to the murals, and take some photos. We're gonna have a photo ops in the murals, and then after that, we're gonna go take a bus. Wait, we are taking a bus to Baguio? Yeah, we have to go buy the tickets first, though. Okay, so we're gonna buy the tickets first before we do all the shenanigans because life is happening and it's happening fast. And I gotta catch her. Ow. Fortunately. Yeah. If life is happening and it's happening fast, there's no choice, sis. Grab your ankles. <laughs> Amazing choice so far. Um, yeah, this is I don't know how you found this whimsical land. Mm -hmm. I'm so happy. Everything is so amazing in here. So basically, okay. yeah, and the, the owner is also an artist. So, um, and he is bi bipolar. Mm -hmm. And this is his house. Let's do this. Should I do okay? Not spicy. What are we doing? Soup appetizer. I think I'm gonna do the. Uh, I'm gonna do the experience. Yeah. Oh, I'm actually thinking of signature piece. Mel gives his darkest sins as Marilyn Monroe's messy ice lolly. I'm in love with this place. They give you a map of like walking around the restaurant. Of like what's where and what you can see. Hey, sinful or wholesome? Sinful. Order the food based on like do you want happy? Do you want calm? I think calm, calm. For dessert it was wholesome or sinful. So I don't know what it's gonna be. But I know she's gonna be sinful. That's all I know. Guys, the like servers can have our tea, but we have to. By the way, guys, this is the Florida place. Oh, yeah. Okay, let's pick our teapot. <laughs> oh, that was so these are teapots, That's the one that I was thinking. Uh, collections of yeah, the owner of the <laughs> Oh, wow. Uh, I think my. And if you want ice this one, the Chinese one. Oh, okay. This one? No, no, no. The one behind? Right the one right here. Right here. The wire one. Oh, oh yeah. This that's is, the one we both Yeah, this is what we both have. <laughs> so could you have tea? We have here a mood tea bar. We have a mood wheel here. You get to choose some mood that you want to wheel. And there's a corresponding tea you want. So for example, if you're stressed or sad, you're going to get happy chill. If you're anxious or worried, light chill. If you're a little bit insomnia or bitchy today, <laughs> extra calming. So we have here the tea leaves. We have here organic stevia as we can learn. We also have cocoa sugar on your table if you're not fond of organic stevia. We have six easy ways on how to make your own tea here. Please disregard the measurements because it will depend on how you would like your tea to be. Mm -hmm. This is um, Philippine citrus mm -hmm. here and then hot water. Mm -hmm. It's dressed on a skirt so don't be cold. <laughs> yeah. Thank you. Welcome. Mm -hmm. So each of you can make your own by the way because you might have different needs. Okay. Oh yeah, so we pick different teapots. Teapots, yeah. yeah. And then after that, well, okay, so where's number four? Four is as it is. This is cool. Sorry. This are cool. I definitely want this. I just... <laughs> This way? You navigator, go navigate. <laughs> <laughs> um, the door to the garden. So that's a 
the garden and breathe. Breathe in through your nose for four seconds. Hold your breath for seven seconds. Breathe out through your mouth for eight. Go. Oh, this looks so good. Oh my god. Oh my god. Go to the alkalizing thigh body station using med the medicine dropper. Take three drops of sodium bicarbonate potion. Number one bottle, commonly known as baking soda. Um, wait, number five is inside. Okay. It's inside. Oh my gosh. Little kitties. Oh my god. <laughs> it's their children. It's a whole family. Hi guys. Hi kitties. So you may take this directly into your mouth. Just don't let it touch your tongue or you may also use the, um, the a small a tiny um, shots like this. So take three drops of the number one. Okay. And then? And then take three drops of the number two. This is number two. Yeah, number two, three. Oh. <laughs> research on diets that can help uh, stay away from taking it. So the food here is actually his medication. It's meant to improve the neurotransmitters of our body. And also it's made out of all natural ingredients and organic grown products. Most of us working here is also the condition, so we also promote mental health awareness here in the Philippines. So we uh, embrace different disabilities here. So I have my baby to one in the kitchen has autism, and some of us has uh, BSTD, ADHD, and schizophrenia. So this place is uh, full of love and conditions. Our food also are named or inspired after famous personalities who have mental health conditions. So this is Axel Rose of Guns and Roses. Basically egg, raw organic eggs with so warm water. So why raw egg? Raw egg, by the way, has its natural enzyme that fights stress. So this is uh, a stress buster concoction I'm making for you guys. So if you're stressed with something to do today, this can help you chill out. Which is getting the yolk. And the bottom part of the concoction, this is a stress buster concoction I'm making, uh, tamarind extract. Since it's a season for tamarind right now. So raw sea salt is a naturally sun-dried salt. It did not undergo any processes. So it contains its natural forms of minerals and zinc from the sea. So it's good for your immune system. Basically 87 minerals. Unlike the processed ones. This one is spice. So a little spice is also good to lower the stress hormone, which is the cortisol. And also apple cider vinegar. So apple cider vinegar, it's good for your digestion. And anything that is something sour is also good to lower the stress rate. My personal favorite is raw honey, mm -hmm. wild honey. So it's a natural tranquilizer and also helps aid anxiety. So you'll know that your honey is real. If you put it in the microscope, you can still see the enzymes moving. So this is a German herb-based liquor with 56 herbs and spices in it. People thought it's just for recreational drink. Actually, it originated in Germany as a cough syrup and helps them uh, warm during the winter. So I've asked all my guests, all my German guests, to confirm that. <laughs> so I'll just. This will help mask the taste of the yolk, by the way. At the same time, give some kick to your concoction. 
So guys, we'll take this in a shot. Yeah, thumbs up. Now here in Van Gogh is bipolar. We say our cheers in a different language. So I'll be giving you cheers from Greece or Greek cheers. Yamas. 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 And you should guys look at each other's eyes because there's a corresponding curse for not looking at each other's eyes. Do you know what the curse is? Seven years of bad sense. You know what that happens? So look at each other's eyes and say yamas and take the shot. Bottom up because masarap yung pinaka bus. Okay. Alright. Yamas. 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 That's amazing. Can the honey. Where do you get your honey? We get it from his best friend's farm. Oh wow. So this farm is so long already. And that was only the first time that we So what kind of teas did you guys get? Upper and soothing. So soothing is uh, made out of avocado leaves. Mm -hmm. Upper is uh, guava leaves. Is that super upper? Uh, the extra upper is tamarind leaves. Mm -hmm. That's what I have. So I think I have the happy calm. Yeah. Happy calm? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I have happy calm. So, for happy chill, uh, oh, it's happy chill. Mm -hmm. mango leaves. Mm -hmm. So, it's all Philippine leaves, guys. So beautiful. So, it varies also. If you see some online pictures, our food varies a lot. So, this, this is just a new set. And we don't Thank have you. specific ingredients because every day we go to the market. So, what's fresh in the market? So first, I'll introduce you to the soup. It's mm -hmm. called Virginia Wolf Tears. So it's made out of uh, wild mushroom. So and uh, vegetable broth. You will pour it over here, mm -hmm. and then we also have a drink. You will pour it over your wine glass. It's called uh, Courtney Love's Potion. <laughs> So what's fresh for today is tamarind extract. So tamarind, by the way, is good for your liver. It cleanses the liver at the same time. Um, it lowers cholesterol levels. This one is your rice. It's called black mountain rice. It's also called the forbidden rice because um, in a year, it only has a very minimal harvest because it grows in the mountainous area in the northern part of the Philippines. It's also called the happy rice because it contains 100% pure fiber and antioxidant. So it's good free to eat rice today. If you want more rice, just get your request for more, we'll give you more. These are your main courses. So we have free range chicken for today, and you have vegan. And then this is your dessert. Now for your dessert, just kindly you set this aside here, this two, because there's a certain preparation for it. Once you're ready, just kindly press that one. I'll be there and um, I'll, be, I'll prepare it just like the egg one. Okay. All right. Thank you. Yeah. On the food? Uh, the food was amazing. It was so but good. The experience so don't is precious. <laughs> I sound like a MasterCard commercial, but it really is. Did you have a favorite like part or favorite dish? Part, um, oh, favorite dish. Um, for me, it was uh, the soup mm -hmm. and the shot. The shot. Mm -hmm. like, the shot. So, like, mm -hmm. like just a combination of flavors um, and just like where the ingredients came from. Mm -hmm. um, I really like the whole thing like just everything like, playing, like having to pick your hat and like kind yeah. of like just like digging up like your the, that part of you that you lost mm -hmm. after you know like society told you you're an adult you're not supposed to do mm -hmm. dress up or whatever i love that we wrote things on the wall too yeah, yeah. yeah. and express things that yeah. And we have one more thing. We have one more thing. We get a dessert. There's a shoe. Should I honk on it? That plant. Oh wow, there is. Are you ready? 
Yes, yeah. please. Okay. Oh, thank you. I'm really excited to write or do a whole comprehensive oh, video for this. Mm -hmm. yeah. Wow. Okay. Thank you, Paul. Thank you. Thank you. Have a great day, guys. Okay. Father, brother, thank you so much. And hope to see you there. Marikar! Yes, thank you so much. I really wish that there was like a, a time warp portal. Or like, what? Like a. What's that called? When you, there's like portal. a. a yeah, that. But I'm thinking of like a. How you get somewhere without going there. A teleportation. Teleport. Device. Okay. Yeah. You're so pretty. I wish there was a teleportal. Like right teleport. outside here. Mm -hmm. Yeah. That's what it feels like. You just come here. here. <laughs> I know. This, if I, yeah. And I'm happy that you're here in a lunch as well. For daytime, actually, this is a sanctuary as well. You can cry here, just make, um, uh, hang out at the garden. So we allow them. And there are some beggars and street kids also come here and get them free food. Mm -hmm. So that's part of our advocacy, which is called the Love Project. So, for your dessert, it's called Mel Gibson's Darkest Sin, our sinful dessert. At the same time, it's our signature dessert. The main ingredient is absinthe or absinthe in French. So this is our version of the 16th century French herb liquor, which is a favorite drink of Vincent Van Gogh. So the usual preparation of this, they just pour it over white cube sugar, but with us, we choose to burn it to release the essence of the alcohol and use cocoa sugar instead of white sugar. Nice. So this is medicinal by nature, but when taken excessively, it's known to make you hallucinate and you will see green fairies. That's why it's also called the green fairy drink. So this came from a plant called mermaid. Mermaid is medicinal by nature, but if not uh, prepared in the right way, it could be poisonous. So during 16th century, this is actually used as an anesthetic during that time. So people just uh, discovered it that it's hallucinogenic, so they drink it as a recreation. So guys, I'll let you make a wish. Make your wishes now, and mm -hmm. I'm counting to three, you may blow. One, two, three. Great! Oh. The wishes will come true. So we'll take this as a shot. And then your chaser would be our homemade dark chocolate. So we made it from scratch, the chocolate. Pure cocoa and honey. So I'll give you cheers from Russia or Russian cheers. It's Nazdarovia. Nazdarovia. And still, look each other in the eyes. Nazdarovia. Nazdarovia. By her. Ooh. Ooh. This is a nice water. That's really good. Mm. I'm just scraping mine. I know. And like that, like crunch from the flour mm -hmm. was also really good. It's it so good. It's a beautiful one here. Excited? Uh, yes, ma'am. <laughs> within the walls, the city within the walls. Here's the walls. <laughs> Ready for picture, Nick. Mm -hmm. Ready for picture. Uh oh. Uh oh. Asagi. Okay. 